Welcome to the Video Dictionary, where we explore the history of the language and the words we use every day. My name is Benjamin Lewis. If you enjoy history and language, consider subscribing and click the little bell so you never miss a word. This time we have another word I've stolen straight from The Simpsons. Yoink! Exclamation! An onomatopoeic exclamation accompanying or describing a yank or snatch. Verb to take or snatch. History and etymology. Now, I haven't been able to find a definitive first recorded use of the word yoink. There are a couple of things that we do know about the word, though. First, is that it's obviously an onomatopoeia. And second, that it was popularized by, well, what else? The Simpsons. Yoink! 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 Initially, going into this investigation, I was under the impression that the word yoink was created by one of the Simpsons writers. But as I was researching, I found a couple of dead links that supposedly went to a tweet from Bill Oakley, a former showrunner of The Simpsons where he said he stole the word from an Archie comic. And that sent me down a whole rabbit hole of searching for the first attestation of the word. But let's go back to the beginning. If yoink is onomatopoeic, what sound is it imitating? Grabbing things doesn't really make any kind of a sound. And if it did, it probably isn't going to be a sound like yoink. I think it all goes back to the days of old-time radio and early animations and silent movies. In the days of radio dramas, there were no visuals, and everything had to be represented by sound. Even some actions that didn't make sounds. This includes sounds for yanking things, or moving things, or any number of things like that. And in early animation, they couldn't easily sync recorded sound with film, so all the sound effects were written into the scores played by the bands in the theater. So the sound effects were played on instruments. This seems to be an explanation of how some silent actions came to have noises associated with them. That's why I think the story about the Simpsons showrunner getting the sound from the Archie comic makes a lot of sense. Comics were where a lot of spellings for onomatopoeic sounds came from. But The Simpsons took this onomatopoeia and made it a word that people use all the time when they grab or take something usually by surprise. Yoink! 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 Yoink. 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 Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed this video or you feel you've learned something, please leave a like and share it with a friend you think would enjoy it. Make sure you subscribe and click the little bell so that you never miss a word. If you feel like helping support this little project of mine, visit the links below to help support the project. And until next time, keep on learning.